One day, a poor man made his way to the monastery where the Buddha resided. Upon seeing a monk, he bowed respectfully and then asked, Greetings, Dharma Master. May I see the Buddha? Noticing the man looked weighed down, the monk inquired, Is everything all right? The man replied, I have a question about life that I need to ask the Buddha. So the monk led him in. Upon seeing the Buddha, the man prostrated before him. When he finished, he said, Venerable Buddha, my life has always been a constant struggle. Since I was born, I've been living in poverty. I heard people say that fortune favors the generous. But how can someone like me, who has nothing to begin with, ever practice generosity? Please enlighten me. The Buddha smiled and said compassionately, You don't have to be wealthy to be generous. I will teach you seven ways to give none of which require material wealth. First, you can give with your eyes. When you encounter someone visually impaired, offer your guidance and help them find their way. Give them a hand, be their eyes. Second, smile more often. Greet others warmly with a smile. Avoid appearing sullen or grumpy. If you do, others may want to keep away from you. So remember to be gentle and cheerful. Always be friendly to others. Third, whenever others speak about you, whether to your face or behind your back, always respond with kind words. Likewise, speak well of others, whether they are present or not. Fourth, use your physical strength to assist others. For example, some people may become weak due to injuries. When you see someone like that struggling to carry a heavy item, extend your hand to help lighten their load. Fifth, always keep a kind heart and look for the good in everyone around you. Whoever you come across, try to recognize the positive qualities in others. The Buddha continued to say, Sixth, respect and honor the elderly. Elderly people have contributed significantly to society. They deserve our respect and gratitude.
Lastly, be kind and loving to children, the needy, the physically challenged, and all creatures of the earth. Embrace all living beings with love and compassion. These seven acts of kindness don't cost a thing and are completely within your power to do. After learning that one does not need to be materially wealthy to do good, the man was delighted and assured the Buddha he would practice these seven ways of giving from that moment forward. Giving doesn't require material wealth. Anyone can give through simple acts.